Founders Pick is named after the train line that runs between O'Hare Airport and downtown Chicago and brings him as close as he can get to his hometown's deep dish pizza creations. In San Carlos, it's called Blue Line Pizza. Our Chicago-style pizza is really unique. It's actually more like a pie. It has a really thin crust with a lot of filling in it with red sauce on top. We have people eating it all different ways. We have just the normal you know, holding it up with your hand and having fun with the cheese oozing down. We have others that prefer a, a knife and a fork. My name is Angela Pace, and I'm the CEO and founder of Blue Line Pizza. We were actually born out of our sister concept in San Francisco called Little Star Pizza. Our first store was in downtown Campbell, and since then we've grown to seven units throughout the Bay Area. The name Blue Line Pizza actually was born out of our deep dish roots in Chicago. The Blue Line train is the main train between O'Hare and downtown Chicago. We thought it'd be kind of fun to name ourselves Blue Line, just a subtle nod to our Chicago deep dish roots. Blue Line was really designed to be a real comfortable, casual atmosphere. It's somewhere because of our full bar that um, the grown-ups can relax and perhaps have a date night out with their adult beverages. The food actually lends itself to a wider audience where um, kids can come and enjoy as well as grandma and grandpa. My criteria for a good pizza is the quality of the products, the freshness of the ingredients. That is what's gonna make a pizza taste different. All right, my fellow Chicagoan, Andrew, I said I'm going to get my hard A's back. Exactly, my, exactly, you know. <laughs> exactly. exactly. Um, what did you discover when you moved out here, that there was no deep dish pizza? Well, it, it's not that there's no deep dish pizza. There's Chicago. all these abominations of pizza with <laughs> ham and pineapple and arugula. I found when I moved out here that everything had to be organic <laughs> and was harvested while being serenaded by a string quartet. <laughs> and so I'm a Chicagoan, so we're a little more pragmatic about it's it. It's grown in the snow. No, well, fine. yeah, exactly. No, I believe in being a local born organic and all that, but every now and then you need a proper pizza <laughs> and it's hard to find on the West Coast. Right. And so Blue Line got it right. The classic deep dish is perfect in the way that the crust, it's a corn a cornmeal corn. crust, mm -hmm. and so that makes it nice and crisp and buttery and strong enough to hold up all that mountain of goodness right. without feeling like cardboard. And the most important thing about the rest of the ingredients, yes, it's a big piece of pizza, but it's kind of fluffy and light. It's not just a brick. So they got that combination of just the right amount of cheese. The tomato sauce was light and fresh and didn't feel canned or processed mm -hmm. in any way. And so all the proportions of all the different ingredients were pitch perfect. So it, it hit all the checklists on what makes a proper deep dish. All right, you're getting schooled on Chicago deep dish. Chelsea, what did you think? I have to agree, the deep dish was excellent, although I don't have any Chicago relatives to compare it to. <laughs> it was amazing. We actually got the Mediterranean style one, and so oh. it advertises. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his face, don't do that. That's not deep dish, that's one of those California things. <laughs> well, considering I am from California, I followed my <laughs> and it was actually great because it advertises marinated artichoke hearts, which they were. They were really juicy, and the peppers that were in there as well, they also seemed to be marinated because they just had this really vibrant flavor. And then they had the green olives in there also, which were great because they added a little bit of a difference in texture, but also added some saltiness to it. Mm -hmm. So it was just a really well-balanced dish. The crust was to die for. Yeah. Linda, what did you think? Well, I had the deep dish pizza and I had uh, the classic because that Perfect. was what was recommended. It was nice layering. The, the ingredients were really top notch, I thought. But the crust, you know, there I'm going to go there first. <laughs> and it was really great. Yeah. <laughs> really? Like, oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Sweating all the characters. Makeup. <laughs> but the crust was very, very good. I would have to say the appetizers and the salads I was not impressed with at all. I thought the appetizers were kind of all over the map um, mm -hmm. with shishito peppers with a chev uh, dip, which is what we had, but they had wings and they had some traditional things that you'd have at a, a pizza mm -hmm. place. Um, the salad, they didn't dry the romaine very well, so oh. it was wet so that when they 
they tossed it in the dressing, did. it didn't cling. I, I do want to interject here on one thing <laughs> is that's not what that place is about. Right. But when push comes to shove, this is about the pizza. Right. So I get that. So when I go, we usually don't do the dessert because you can't move after the deep dish. Right. <laughs> and the appetizers maybe. Well, I was going to say I want to interject there because we actually did have an appetizer that was delicious. We ordered the chicken wings. Mm -hmm. And it's a generous portion, mm -hmm. but they have this great spice to them. And it's actually served with a blue cheese that's made in-house. And our server was saying that a lot of people kind of just skip over the blue cheese and instantly order ranch. I have to highly recommend against that because it's an excellent sauce. It paired really nicely with the wings. Yeah. We also got a thin crust pizza. Oh. <laughs> and most Chicagoans will eat thin crust as well. Okay. The deep dish is more of a special occasion, okay. but a, okay. a good you know, thin crust. It yeah. was a good thin crust. It was actually very delicious. We got the um, pesto chicken. Mm -hmm. The pesto really complimented it. You could taste pine nuts they had actually used in it. Um, and, you know, each bite you took, it got better and better. Again, another really great dish. And what'd you wash that down with? Because we in Chicago are good at washing it down, down with, with a little mm -hmm. brisky, brisky so. or something. What'd you wash it down with? <laughs> the drink menu is something that I actually think makes this restaurant particularly special mm -hmm. because Absolutely. their beer selection is phenomenal. Their wine choices were a little limited, yeah, but very I limited. mean, you're yeah. going there for beer and pizza. Yeah, I was just right. going to say, if you're going to a mm -hmm. pizza place for wine, then no. Um, well, I have to say that the pours there are ginormous, so that made me very happy. <laughs> the driver is a good thing I to ordered, have, yes. My, my friend and I ordered a, a glass of Prosecco. They brought a big wine glass filled you know, three quarters of the way with Prosecco. <laughs> like, well, this is going to be a great night. This isn't about the gourmet fine dining. This for me is about comfort food and a really beautifully presented pizza that makes my little Chicago heart soar for a few <laughs> minutes, and it really does. All right, your spot. Give us a quick summary. Traditional Chicago deep dish. That's the most authentic thing you can get west of O'Hare. All right, and Chelsea. Great drinks, great food, great choice for a casual pizza spot. And Linda. Great neighborhood place, uh, great pours, and great uh, deep dish pizza. If you would like to try Blue Line Pizza, it's located on San Carlos Avenue at Laurel Street in San Carlos. The telephone number is 650-610-0200. It's open for lunch and dinner every day. Reservations are accepted for large groups. And the average dinner tab per person without drinks is under $15. Check Please Bay Area is made possible by the members of KQBD and by Safe Catch Elite Wild Tuna, great for athletes, kids, and pregnancy. Safe Catch tests each and every fish for mercury. Available at nearby stores. Walmart Global E-Commerce with small, agile work teams is focused on big data, engineering, and e-commerce innovations. Careers available at walmartlabs.com. Sutter Health CPMC, investing in community care for more than 150 years, including two new smart hospitals. Your city, your hospital. CPMC2020.org. Natural Mattress Systems from European Sleepworks, working to improve comfort and wellness for over 40 years. European Sleepworks in Berkeley, online at sleepworks.com. Oakland International Airport. Now with flights all over the world. iFlyOAK.com. IRG has over 250 types of natural stone choices in stock today. IRG in Brisbane and Dublin or at marblecompany.com. 